in this video we'll see what a circular sector looks like if it has the same perimeter and the same area as the square. So we start with a given square. That means that each side A is known. And we want to find R and L so that the sector and the square have equal perimeters and equal areas. Therefore, A is known while R and L are unknown. Now the perimeter of the square is equal to 4 times a and the perimeter of the sector is equal to r plus r plus l which is equal to 2r plus l. Since the perimeters are equal then 4a is equal to 2r plus l. The area of the square is equal to a squared and in the previous video we showed that the area of a sector is equal to L times R over 2. Since the areas are equal, then A squared is equal to L times R over 2. Here we have two equations and two unknowns, R and L. Remember that we started with a given square, so its side A is known. Now we'll find R and L in terms of A. From the first equation, we have that L is equal to 4A minus 2R. And that is equal to 2 times 2A minus R. Now, if we put that in the second equation, we get that A squared is equal to 2 times 2A minus R times R over 2, which is equal to 2a minus r times r, and that is equal to 2a r minus r squared. And when we move this to the left side, we get that a squared minus 2a r plus r squared is equal to 0. Now, this is the square of a binomial which is in this case a minus r squared and that is equal to 0. But that can only be if a minus r is equal to 0. Which means that r is equal to a. So we found the radius and it is equal to the side of the square. To find the arc length we just need to put a instead of r in this expression. The arc length is equal to 2 times 2a minus a and that is equal to 2a. So, if a sector has the same perimeter and area as the square, then its radius is equal to a, while the arc length is equal to 2a. With that in mind, I leave you with this problem. The side of a square has length a. A sector has two times greater area and perimeter than the square. Express the radius and arc length of that sector in terms of a. That is all for this video. If you liked it, click the like button, it helps with the YouTube algorithm. And I'll see you next time.